Cognitive processing therapy, the Cliff Notes version of what we're trying to do is if you change the way that you think, you can change the way that you feel. One that often comes up is the I shoulda, coulda, woulda. So let's say for instance, somebody's friend dies in an IED blast, pretty common occurrence if you were deployed to Iraq and Afghanistan. And a couple of the vets that have been through our program believe that, hey, I, I should have spotted the IED. When they're reminded of that event, they are reminded of a very small portion of the entirety of the event. And so part of what we try to do in treatment is go from the boots on the ground type of perspective to the thousand foot view to see the entire battlefield. And part of how we do that and recreate that in session is by asking a lot of questions. Mental health providers don't have an MRI or a CT scanner that's like, hey, yep, that's exactly where we're aiming. That's the, the, the problem, right? We get to do that by asking a lot of calculated and specific questions. And so if I should have spotted the IED was the small portion of the event that you go to, we want to know what happened to the left and to the right. So some of the questions that I would have are like, what happened during the safety brief before you went out? What intelligence did you have before you went outside the wire? How long was your convoy? How many vehicles were in your convoy? How many people were on that mission? Who was the one deciding to go left or right? Where were you positioned before the IED went off? Were you in the front vehicle? Were you in the last vehicle? Were you a gunner? Were you inside the vehicle? All those contextual details are extremely important to examining the accuracy of that particular event. All the stuff before and after, as well as during, we really wanna to try to get as much detail as possible because that can help us help that veteran gain a more balanced view of that traumatic event. So that's cognitive processing therapy in a very small nutshell.